Well, hello there, you sweet toe beans. It's your boy, them curvy toes. We are back playing Pixel Survivors Roguelike once again today. Uh, they keep dropping patch after patch after patch for this game. Been having an absolute blast with it. Uh, so thank you so much, you guys, for all the love you've been showing on the channel as of late and on all the videos, not just the Pixel Survivors Roguelike ones. I love you guys so very, very much. We're over 200 subscribers, which absolutely blows my mind, and I am so moved so thank you you guys seriously from the bottom of my heart with that out of the way beans all the all the soft boy stuff we're gonna be playing a standard run today and we're gonna be playing as the archaeologist indiana jones himself and we are actually gonna be playing in the dungeon because i need <coughs> Ooh, hey, excuse me we are gonna be playing in the dungeon because i need some of these dragon tails we're gonna get a pet i'm gonna figure out what those do eventually and so i did unlock a passive card at the beginning of the run this is like one of the empowered passives i guess i would uh i would call it uh, and we are going to take the demon slayer emblem for the additional xp gain and here we go already creates a powerful slash at the enemy's position i just unlocked this uh we're doing a run earlier today so we're gonna we're gonna check that out see what that does okay that's some anime stuff i like that we're gonna take some additional movement speed my volume turned down or something it was okay it was actually in my headphones not uh, not in the game I must have brushed up against it oh man we got a lot of skeletons going on right now uh yeah we're gonna take fire shield I love I love that ability and I feel like Indy Indy would uh, take a fire shield given the opportunity someone's one soul sword around yourself to attack the enemies thunderstorm yeah we'll take soul swords indiana jones has spent spending too much time in the temple of doom and now ooh, kamehameha let's go and now he is goku with uh soul swords fireball i'm gonna re-roll this re-roll again star rain or yeah we're gonna take electric sword actually i do like the electric sword it throws purple lightning all over the screen making me feel like emperor palpatine ooh Wait, more XP gain? Yes, please, and thank you. Don't mind if I do. 20% crit damage. All right. Our crit chance, I believe, is going to be pretty low. Yep, 10% off the rip, but we'll get those numbers up real quick. And then... Do I, I, I do want Molotov, but I feel like I take that every time I play this. So we're going to reroll. 3% crit chance. I always take Molotov and Explosions. Like, I feel like... They're some of the best attacks in the game. So, Blizzard Blade it is. All right, we've committed. We got a lot of swords and Kamehameha's and all kinds of wild stuff going on right now. But, Beans, I'm not too worried about it because we are going to tear through this run like a knife through butter. 20% more damage on Fire Shield, so when it's up, we can uh, really start tearing up some little goblin faces over here. And right now we're not even getting close enough to use our fire shield. That will not be the case later on in the run. Now one of the attributes... Oh, a glizzy. One of the attributes I really want to get up is luck because that will affect how many chests we get. Not only meta currency, but the passive upgrades as well. More crit chance. Yes, please. Indiana Jones is a critical man. I'm really hoping that the new, uh, the new movie is better than... Uh, Better than the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. I cannot... <laughs> I cannot stress enough that uh, I did not like that movie. I feel like I talked about that in another video, but... It just was not a... just was not a good movie. We're gonna take some... Uh, uh, we're gonna take some pickup radius, actually, just to... Just to be safe. The defense wouldn't be a bad idea, but right now, at this point in the run, it's not super necessary, so... Ooh, now we got some big old gooblins coming. And soul swords. Yep. Hmm. Two more targets on electric sword. Oh, is that... Was me... Pressing E re-rolling it? Oh, shit. I think I might have accidentally re-rolled those abilities. Or maybe I got three levels in a row and like at once somehow I'm not really sure my how the turntables though we got pizzas and glizzies all over the ground 10% cooldown on water breathing I like that 
Like I said, I just unlocked that ability earlier today, just kind of doing a, uh, a run specifically actually to try and unlock that ability. So kind of cool to see that pop up right away. Big coin bag. Ah, I've bought pretty much everything there is to buy in the meta currency tree at this point. I mean, I've definitely put some time into the game, so it makes sense, but gold doesn't really do anything for me at this point. Ooh, risky card. All right. So these, I initially thought you could only take one. These are actually garbage, huh? Minus 10% attack speed, plus 15% attack. So we can pick that one. And then we will grab that. Ooh, we do have a level available. 20% attack speed. All right. I don't know what attack speed really does. If it is like cooldown or... Ooh, our first elite. Or if it... Uh, just the actual speed at which the projectiles move. We got crit chance. We got an eel. And we're going to save the magnet because I did unlock the uh, ability in the meta progression tree where magnets can open chests, I believe. So we're just going to kind of circle around this at this point. Oh, all right. Water breathing, an additional projectile. So now we got... Yep, I saw two of them down there. Perfect. I'm going to try and remember that that magnet is there. So I don't accidentally be like, oh, red XP, and then run right into it. Because that is definitely something I would do. Another risk reward thing. Minus 50% attack speed plus 50% attack. Hell yeah, brother. What do we got? 5% more crit chance? Absolutely. That'll bring us up to 26% crit chance. And we are already hitting for Boku damage. I really want to get our uh, get our luck here. We haven't gotten any upgrades to luck. And it is at 15, so I guess that would just be from the character and the meta progression I have unlocked, I would assume. There we go. Got them dead, them dead. Got lots of XP. Making our way through the hood. More luck. Luckier luck. Now luck is going to help <clears throat> with spawning chests. And what is in those chests, if I'm not mistaken, which I very well could be. Okay, so I think attack speed is projectiles, because I feel like these swords are moving much slower than normal. Oh my god, we're up to 31% crit chance already? That's what I like to see! Man, these little fast goblins are, uh, are annoying. Oh, we got red XP just chilling all the way up here. We got Indy with a shotgun. I do like Indy music. Ba -ba 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 -da. Dad jokes. That's all I got. All I got is dad jokes and depression. Ah, yes. A second beam on Kamehameha. Eventually, we'll have it basically Kamehameha's all around us. And then the upgrade makes them bigger and damagier. Like, the, not the upgrade, the, uh, the evolution. Which in this game, you don't need specific abilities or combinations to evolve anything. You just need to essentially get another item either from a chest or from leveling up. Uh, so long as you have that ability um, in, your, uh, in your active bar. Alright, so definitely starting to feel the enemies piling up a little bit here. Should probably have grabbed the XP now that I think about it, but... Whoop. We are getting uh, we are getting a lot of XP. Hey, there we go. ASCII shall receive. Let's go. Grab some meta currency. Not that that really does anything for us, but... There is a, uh, there is a passive uh, card, I guess, you can take. Uh, that makes it so gold heals you for 20%, or if you take it when you're at full health, it actually raises your maximum health. So I feel like this would be a excellent run to get that on. High luck, good, uh, good damage dealing down the way. And we got the Minotaur. I think we did already take at least one move speed up, so we're going to be able to more effectively stay away from him. We are already melting his health bar, which is what I like to see. Yeah, he's already at yellow at this point, so we're doing good. All right, what do we got over here? We got a regen. The fish, I want to say, is dodge. I don't know. All right, let's grab... Oh my god, please just... Uh... All right, and then a crit damage up. 
All right. Another risky, rewardy card. 15% crit rate, minus 15% crit damage, plus 30 luck. Yes, plus 30 luck is going to be huge. And we have a level here for some reason. More damage on that. Oh, I got a free revive out of that as well. None of the evolutions yet. But uh, all that extra luck, I mean, our luck is going to be almost 60 at this point, right? 20. I thought it said an extra 30 luck. Did I not pick the right one? Oh shit, maybe, uh, I don't know what happened there. Well, we'll figure it out, I guess. Either way, we're just killing things left and right. Uh, yeah, 15% more crit damage. I do have plenty of rerolls available at this point, but no sense in using them until we need them. Glizzies to the left, glizzies to the right, we're run hungry, boy. Look at that skeleton over here, probably getting slapped around by Goku Indiana Jones, the crossover we didn't know we needed. Already level 30, where is my soda? Broke down, I got some McDonald's today, Beans. I don't know, I was I was, I was hungry, I took a nap. And I was like, woke up, I was like, I'm not cooking, but I'm starving. So naturally, you just gotta, uh... Naturally, you just kinda gotta go with the McDonald's at that point. Also, I've been eating Taco Bell like crazy lately, I'm kinda burnt out on it. He says is he will probably get Taco Bell tomorrow. All right, this build is feeling spicy so far. I'm liking this. Indiana Jones himself would be proud. Harrison Ford Fiesta. All right, what do we got? More movement speed. Good. Indy is a nimble man. Gotta be to run away from Shorty. What is going... What is... This aura around us. I guess it like freezes enemies? I'm not really sure. Alright, and we should just about be getting a level here. Yep, there we go. Alright, we are gonna reroll that. More luck. Luckier luck. And what do we have down here? A bunch more meta currency. Like I said, I am saving that. Ooh, okay. He should be dying here at some point. Maybe not. We got an invulnerable kobold buddy thing. All right, I mean, shit, we're hitting for like 1,500 damage. I'll take it. That's gonna be, oh, damage up, dodge up, and critical damage up, perfect. All right, our build is our build is feeling plenty spicy at this point, and it is only uphill from here, beans. Damage to frozen or stunned enemies is increased by 30%. Or two more targets on electric sword sounds good to me. I don't know if we have anything. I guess this aura around us freezes enemies, so I probably should have grabbed that. Only a single rip there. That's going to be more max health. Yep, 3% more. We're doing just fine in the health department for right now. We got plenty of healing just littered around the map. Blizzies and pizza, and there's like a, a cake or something over here. Two cakes. One for the plug and one for the money. Get all this blue XP out of here. I want, I want them red ones. I have no idea what's creating this like frozen aura around us. Maybe Blizzard Blade? That's like a frost ability. That would make sense to have like a uh, freezy thing going on. Ooh, 20% more damage on the electric sword. Well, we're 10 minutes in and we are not struggling whatsoever at this point. All the damage I take is basically just me being sloppy or a little too ballsy for my own good. 
Don't you worry, Beans. We're gonna we're gonna get to the point of absolute bustitude on this run. I can feel it. I said I wanted to play on this map to get uh, things, you know, bits and baubles for a pet, and I've yet to find any of them. So that's a triple ripper, though, Beans. A little more crit chance and instant kill chance. Ooh, we're already at 56% crit chance. That is what I like to see. 20%. Base damage? Absolutely. That is a good upgrade to take, I'll tell you what. Yeah, we're hitting for 2400 there, 1300 there, yeah. Yep, our build is our build is spicy beans. Here we are, this the peppermint patty spice. Another collab we didn't know we needed. Peanuts and UK's finest, the Spice Girls. Peppermint Patty, that's from Peanuts, right? Or am I tripping? Reroll. Three second duration on Fire Shield. That's good. I love that. That's like one of my favorite abilities in the game. Haven't really gotten any, uh, any uh, upgrades for it yet. So nice to grab that. And the Gooblin King. Oh, he looks grumpy. I would be too if I was uh, if I was looking like that. I get it, buddy. Be loud, be proud, but also please, you know, be be dead. All right, so I'm gonna go hit this magnet and see if that opens. Plus two targets, less cooldown. Let's see what that? Okay, so it didn't open that I'm not sure ooh two five holy shit that one was like all magnets uh, <laughs> somehow managed to not hit any of those magnets a triple ripper on the boss chest beans some rerolls defense okay well at this point I'm comfortable standing here and letting the XP and whatnot pile up because I'm gonna take a drink of my sprite McDonald's Sprite just hits different. I don't know what it is, what kind of Eldritch Rift Witchcraft they got going on. Reroll again. Size up 20%. Yeah. A little bit of a larger buffer on our fire shield, which is just annihilating anything that comes close to it that isn't an elite or a boss at this point. And quite frankly, the bosses and elites are getting shredded too, so... Can't argue with that. We got a shotgun, we got a fire shield, we're doing just fine and dandy beans. Hey, so I, I don't remember if I've talked about this in an episode that I actually uploaded, or if it's one that, uh, that I had to scrap because I played like crap and died, but I'll say it again. If you, ha or if you have already heard it, I'm sorry. But, uh, you know, I know I've talked on the channel here, I'm, I'm gonna be moving soon. Um, so there's a very real possibility Absorb all XP orbs on the map every 60 seconds, but the XP sucking item <laughs> will no longer appear. Perfect. All right, so we're just going to grab all those while we can. Um, and yeah, I know I had talked about the fact that I'm moving, so there's a very real possibility I'm going to be a little bit sporadic around the beginning of March, both slightly before and slightly after, because um, I'm moving in right at first, second, third, somewhere in there. Um, and I'm, you know, I'm obviously gonna have to get everything set up, and then, you know, I already called to set up the internet, but like, you know, the internet company up here is just absolute trash. At least the one that I went with. No, they're both, uh, there's like two main providers, and they're both trash. The one I picked I, is less trash from my experience, but, you know, so, I'll, I'll let y'all know in the community community section um, what's going on, if something's amiss, or if I'm going to be kind of out of commission for a while. But I appreciate y'all bearing with me through thick and thin. I know a while back there when I first started... Hey, there's our first uh, Dragon Tail. I know a while back when I first uh, started out the channel, I like uploaded a bunch, and then I got COVID and was like dead for like two weeks. So, you know, I just really appreciate uh, you guys, the beans. You, you've stuck with me through a lot. It's been It's been over a year which is really, really weird to think about. And I didn't start doing daily uploads until November of 22, so we have grown exponentially in even that short amount of time. And I just want to thank you guys so much for 
for all the love and, and support you guys have been showing. Triple Ripper Beans. Oh, quadruple. No, quintuple. You know what? You know what I meant. Twenty percent more crit damage is gonna be big. What's our crit chance at? <laughs> Sixty-nine percent. Very nice. That's how you know this run is spicy. Sixty-nine percent crit chance. Here we are, killing everything. How have I only found one dragon tail? That is... That is sadness. I do love that this game is uh, a lot like Bounty of One in that it just has endless mode built into normal runs. Oh god, they're throwing fireballs at us. So I'm looking forward to... Uh, Killing the final boss in this level and going into endless mode and seeing just how far we can we can take it beans To the moon and back We're just gonna take 20% more crit damage because we have a 69% crit chance at this point And something else I would I, I don't know I, again. I don't know if I've talked about it. I like I talk to myself all day at work I talk to myself all day when I'm doing this I just, I never know what when I'm recording and I'm talking to myself, but, because I'm always talking to myself, but, um, I, uh, I got, like, a, uh, a plan-ish <laughs> for how I'm gonna set up the, uh, the second bedroom in my new place for recording, and so a large part of the reason that I kind of started leading into these roguelikes was, A, because I absolutely love them because I think I'm a masochist, but B, because, like, the more graphically intense games with the way my thing is set up right now, my computer is, like, Balls deep in my microphone, so everything is just more XP gain. Ow, shit, I just kicked the shit out of my desk. Oh my god, that hurt so bad. Oh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, but um, yeah, my computer's like balls deep in my microphone. It's just the only way I can have it set up right now in the space I'm in. Um, so anytime I start playing something basically 3D, um, my computer starts to sound like a jet engine and it really, really messes with the audio and try as I might to equalize it and take out certain frequency ranges and stuff I just cannot get it fixed so I'm excited to expand the content that uh, that we can create here and I'll probably get a little bit of soundproofing set up so that'll be exciting more quality or content your content I mean, it's hard to be worse than what I'm putting out already right no I'm usually sometimes <laughs> proud of what I put out onto the YouTube. But I don't watch it just in case it is crap. Woo-wee! Free XP! Oh yeah, I forgot there's a dash in this game. School Lord! Okay. Alright, come on, Elite, buddy. I'm gonna have to ask you to Die quickly. Glizzies. Glizzies, glizzies, glizzies. Alright, I mean, at this point, we are tearing him up. Ooh, water breathing up. And that is gonna be a freeze, and we got a bunch more goodies over there. School Lord, you're frozen. You can't be hitting us with attacks. That's cheating, you son of a bitch. There we go. That's what you get for cheating. Wait, I'm sorry, what was that? Fire Sword now creates Fire Slash Shield. Well, we got it twice, does that mean? What is, ha what just happened? Oh, we got Cotton, uh, which is the uh, uh, Kamehameha evolution. We got two Fire Shields. Wait, what button am I trying to push? Okay, there we go. <laughs> I had no idea what was going on. All right, longer sword path, don't mind if I do. All right, so now we are pretty much at the point of GG's. We got, uh, well, two, technically three upgrades from, uh, two evolution upgrades from that chest. And the evolutions in this game tend to be completely busted, which is how evolution should be. I gotta put in work for that shit. I mean, as you can see, we are just firing a Corona of Goku lasers at this point. We got a bunch of stabby fiery murder swords around us at all times we got glizzies on the floor more xp blizzard blade less cooldown or greater cooldown reduction we're already level 48 all right now we're cruising beans now we're 
we're on easy street. We got hyenas. We got mice kings. We got... I don't even know. Orcs, maybe? Those might be gnolls. I don't know if they're hyenas. Gnolls. I mean, you know, six and one, half dozen the other, basically. Gnolls are hyenas. Ish. Right? Or am I thinking of something else? I might be thinking of something else. 50% more damage on Kamehameha. Absolutely. And I did see a chest up here. What is this? This is gonna be... Yeah, we'll grab water breathing. Why not? Well, did we not pick it up? I thought we picked it up. Must have picked it up because it's gone. Or it disappeared and we got robbed of a passive item. All right, Indiana Jones is not playing around. He has gone Ultra Instinct and he will now shred everything that comes our way. And we are 20, just under 21 minutes into the 30 minute run, at least the base run. And at this point, I am fairly comfortable putting money on the fact that we are triple ripper, on the fact that we are going to be making it into endless mode. All right, that I think is a uh, a nuke item. I forget what they're called, like an extra murdery crystal. And yeah, sure, more luck. Why not? What do we got? We got. What is our crit chance at? Yeah, that was a nuke. Uh, crit rate is at 84%, not quite at 100%. Indy is a crit machine. And it's later in the run. This is when all the luck really starts paying off and we start seeing chests filling up the screen. What's that? That's pepperoni pizza down there. I like, I like that. My favorite pizza beans, and I, this might be blasphemous, this might be blasphemous, pepperoni and green olive. I don't know what it is, but that, ever since I was a kid, like pepperoni and green olives is just mwah, perfection, chef's kiss, best pizza possible. And uh, people, oftentimes people think I'm weird, but that's okay, because I always think I'm weird. Not specifically for that, just kind of a, uh, the general consensus of my sanity is that it is loose at the best of times. Ooh, skirt? Oh yeah, we have a dodge. Indy can dodge. Indy doesn't need to dodge though, and that's how you know we truly are Indiana Jones. Hey, another, uh, rabbit foot or whatever. Dragon tail, that's what it is. Get my anthropomorphic, metamorphosic size critters all uh, betwixt and confused. I don't know what the hell kind of word soup that was just there. Um, none of that was coherent. I apologize. If health is below 40%, never gonna happen. All right, Kamehameha. Oh my God. Oh my God, more beams. Beamier beams, let's go. What do we got? Y'all ain't got nothing. Get out of here. What's going on? Fuck y'all got going on. All right. And all right, now the enemies are starting to pile up here a little bit, but we are taking care of them. All right. Some more meta currency. We're already at 27,000 and some change meta currency for this run. Oh, wow. We got hit there. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll take another level up on water breathing. We're almost at a thousand health already. And we got plenty of glizzies laying about if we do end up getting slapped around a bit. Come on, give us some more chests. I was just talking about how we're going to be inundated with chests and I'm not seeing a whole bunch of them. I'm feeling, I'm feeling like we got robbed here. All right. Well, I mean, maybe I should have been more specific with the game. It did technically give us what I wanted. And 50 per times two electric sword size, 30% now can stuns the enemies. So this is going to be the evolution of the lightning sword, which I don't believe I've seen before. Where is this boss? Oh, there he is. Death himself is about to be dead himself. 
Oh yeah, he does like the weird teleporting thing. Not a fan. Makes it a little, little more difficult to position myself. I mean, we're not gonna, we're not gonna die to death. Hey, another uh, scorpion paw. But I just wanna, I wanna kill him and I wanna get his chest and that's, that's the goal here, but. What do you know, he has some sort of self-preservation. Unlike the rest of these guys who just run at us at top speed, hoping to get a stab or two off before they, for every 700 kills you get one stack. Each stack gives you 5% damage and 50 gold, but max health is reduced. Slashes, slashes the ice sword in many directions. I wish there was a lock. Devs, if you miraculously see this, if you added something in the meta tree to lock down abilities for next time I leveled, oh, it would be perfect. All right, we're gonna take the evolution. Oh God, I just, I wanna punch my microphone and we're gonna get hit by death. All right, and there we killed death himself. We have one more boss left. Slows nearby enemy. Oh, that must be what the aura is from. It's from the crystallized armor, because I think we had more than one of those. Yeah, we have three now. Okay. Mystery solved, beans, I think. Indiana Jones is great at solving ancient mysteries. I don't know if I would quantify that as ancient, but I would quantify it as a mystery. Damage to frozen or stunned enemies is increased by 30%, so I don't think that actually helps us with that. We'll take it anyways. Just in case, you know, just in case. Maybe Blizzard Blade freezes. I don't know. Whatever we got going on is working so far, so I'm not gonna look a gift horse in the question mouth. Another chest, there we go, pass it. Oh, and it's a quintuple rip of beans. Or pickup range, regen, and crit damage up. Perfect, perfection. Ooh, that's gonna be a level for sure. XP, ooh, almost, did I just click on the wrong thing? God damn it. UI's a little wonky in this game. Also, I'm stupid, That that is a big part of it as well. <laughs> oh man, we got a bunch of the actual bosses, like first bosses coming at us now. I'm not scared. Indiana Jones has seen far worse than Minotaurs. Uh, what do we got? Bunch of, bunch of gobbledygook, I believe is the scientific term for it. All right, and we are shredding face right now. 20% more damage on fire shield. Yes, please. Chickens and 10% base damage, yep. Max HP all over the place. Eel, fish, and lots of dodge. Lots of dodge. What's our dodge chance at? 16.5% and we are at almost 100% crit chance. We're close. We are so close, Beans. I can almost taste the 100% uptime on crits. Holy shit, that's a big boy. 50% more damage though. He is gigantic. This is renowned country artist, Garth Brooks. Oh, and he's dead. All right, I shouldn't have been freaked out, I guess. What do we got going on up here? Lots of XP, and eh, we'll grab that the next time the magnet thing procs. 97%, one more crit upgrade ought to do it, and we will be at 100% uptime for critical hits. Feather is attack, yep, attack speed, okay. Come on, criticals. Eh, we're gonna reroll that. Skill cooldown by 5%. We're gonna get the extra 3% eventually anyways, probably from this chest right here if I had to venture a guess. Nope, I lied. Yep, still only at 97%, but the cooldown is that is something you can't pass up in my book. Still, 20% more damage on electric sword. Okay. All right, now you're just trolling us, game. Give us the 3% crit chance. 
See? Trolling. I'm getting trolled. I'm getting trolled by a video game. And the final boss should be coming in the next minute and a half. A little less. Game, come on, give it. Just throw me a bone here, game. Give me the, give me the 3%, just so I can. Oh, uh, uh, nut! How many. Okay, I feel like that was the same amount of beams, but whatever. I think it. they oftentimes get a little weird with taking the evolutions before you've, like, maxed out the ability I found. All right, we got, ooh, the electric sword is shredding face right now. Can we, nope, still at 97% crit chance. Game's having a laugh. Longer sword path, sure. We'll take a longer sword path. That is for darn tootin' sure. Glizzy's Pizza Crit Chance, you absolute son of a bitch. I mean, we're getting we're getting a ton of uh, a ton of good items even without getting 100% crit chance, so I can't complain. Our defense is some 71, so I think we take 71 less damage per hit now. 10% mm, more XP gain sounds good. Always take XP gain if you can. 1,264 HP. Oh shit, and the final boss approacheth. Uh, why is he not taking any damage is what I want to know. We just unlocked some sort of achievement. Still haven't gotten the... Uh, Didn't he have a chest somewhere over here? I swear there was a chest. Ah, eh, we'll find it eventually if it exists. I might have already grabbed it too. Always possible. And yeah, Beans, we're gonna for sure hit infinite mode here. No, I refuse to not get it from a chest. Oh, and hang on, the tool tip is all busted again. How did I do it last time? All right, well, I guess I'll just do that. Just put it up at the top of the screen and forget about it. I'm not even really paying attention to what I'm... Can I help you with this game? There we go. Nope. I thought I fixed it. I did. All right. I'm trying to, like, fix the UI while simultaneously playing the game. Hey, it's early access. 15% more crit damage. There it is, 100% crit ch Okay, game, very funny. 100%, 102% crit chance. Over 100, that's really, that's, that's, that was the goal. Every damage we do is critical. And every time we hit, I swear it's a crit. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Can't you tell this boss dies fast? I always eat ass. All right, <clears throat> ignore me. Stage cleared. Continue for no reward. <laughs> Come on, of course. The reward is the this number of soul swords. Increased to five, the sword became bigger and the damage is greater. Okay, that's the evolution for Soul Sword, I believe. And dual weapons fire one more projectile. What the hell is that? What is this thing? It's like, it's like the boss. I thought we just killed the boss. Different boss, same sadness. Well, he'll die soon enough, I'm sure. Or he won't, and we will. There we go, blood contract. That's the one for every 700 kills we get, we get more damage and all kinds of good stuff like that. Uh, this guy must have a butt ton of health. 
Where'd he go? Did we, did we kill him? He didn't drop a chest if we did. All right, and so yeah, now we're in endless mode and we're just gonna keep on rolling, partner. You know what time it is, re-roll. All right, yeah, we'll take Solier Soul Swords. Oh, there was an elite down there. Was is the key word, because I like, saw him for a moment and then it was gone. 50% more damage on Kamehameha. A whole lot of dead enemies and glizzies all around. Dodge. Dodge. Nope. Only have one dodge and it recharges slow as shit. Hey, there's the crit chance we don't need anymore. Now we're up to 112% crit chance. All chests will drop three items. No, that's... We're going to take a luck up. Because with that, we can't level up our... Our active abilities anymore. And none of them actually are maxed out as of yet. Ooh. Oh, shit. I was like, what hit us? It was death. It was death. Uh, gold gain will also heal yourself at the same amount. If already full, convert 20% healing amount into maximum. Yes. I was just talking about that. How fortuitous. Oh, damn. Death came at us real hard there. And Glizzy's on deck, Gliz, Glizzy's on deck, trying to get us some Glizzy with some Glizzy's on deck. All right, what do we got going on over here? We got uh, a bunch of XP. We got, ooh, death, you ain't touching us today, homeboy. Or maybe you are. I'm not really sure. Where's that gold? I'm trying to get my max health up. All this luck, and I haven't, I can't tell you the last time I saw a chest. All right, there's a chest. Well, now I want the gold. Now the gold actually does something for us. Guess we're just gonna need more luck, beans. And there we go. We're about to pop a level again here. And this is gonna be a freezer thing. Two targets, one second cooldown, sure. I do love the uh, the lightning sword. One of my favorite abilities. I think we'll get an achievement here for getting the archaeologist to level 80, if I'm not mistaken. Three seconds duration on fire shield. Two more targets on el electric sword, yeah. And now we're getting crit chance left and right because this game thinks it's funny. Let's see how broken we can get here, Beans. We're already doing pretty damn well as far as I'm concerned. A lot of chests going on. A lot of extra pat. Shoots one more beam in another direction. Hey, yeah, there we go. There's the achievement for archaeologist. I should probably turn off the steam overlay. Especially for when people... Shoots one more beam, plus 50%. Okay, there. We maxed out Kamehameha. We're close on the water slapping thing. Oh, shit. Here's the, the final boss again. Couple of Kamehamehas to the face will take care of him, though. And I believe he is now dead. Yep, sure looks to be that way. What's this going to give us? Something good? More regen? Sure, why not? And more defense, right? Yeah. Six more defense. Which means our defense is at... Where is it here? 104. Take 104 less damage per hit. If it works how I think it does, which it might... Uh, yeah, 20% more damage on Electric Sword. Why not? Uh, 
All right, more XP, quick chance and dodge. What's our dodge at? 39% chance to dodge. Now dodge does cap out at 90% in this game, so you can't... Ah! Deer waffles. Or... That didn't make sense. It's like trying to make a joke about how stupid I was being earlier and then just like was too stupid for the joke to land. Ah! I don't know how I feel about that. 15% crit chance is going to be a... Or 15%, excuse me. Uh, just, you know what? Just ignore me at this point. More damage is what we got there, and that's what I like. That's the moral of the story. And we are hitting for... 50,000, 84,000. Ooh, I think I saw 100,000 plus somewhere there. You're at it, all the numbers are just kind of starting to bleed together. Which is entirely possible. Ah, another final boss. We ain't scared of you. We are absolutely shredding him. Oh my god, he's gone. Dead. Boom. We are farmers. Bum ba dum bum 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 bum. All right, max out. Electric sword. Very nice. And what do we got going on here? Another sneaky snack. Free frost things. Sure, why not? And you can see why luck is absolutely imperative at this point. That's uh, the easiest way to scale items, especially later into the game. Because once you hit level 85, it doesn't really matter, you know, how much XP up you have. It's going to take a while to level. So for each chest we pick up, we're boosting our stats a little bit. And, uh, you know, making it easier to get the next level and continue further on into the, the run itself. I don't see anything over... Oh, that one, I saw one for 200 and... Yeah, 264,000. Our electric sword is... Our electric sword is doing over 250,000 damage. So, electric sword good, enemies bad. And those two go very well together. Another snacky snack tail, or dragon tail. Apparently we killed an elite down here at some point. Now if we take the 3,000 gold, it does take our max health up, it looks like. Interesting. Okay. So we did get up to 909 health there. Oh, that might have been from leveling up, though, too? I'm not sure. At some point, we're just gonna... We're gonna die from the stacks of killing enemies and gaining damage and losing max health. Or we're going to get to the point where one hit will just absolutely murder us. Twenty percent more damage on fire shield. Don't mind if I do. Now the level ten ability or card for fire shield, I believe, gives it permanent uptime. Which anything that gets close enough to us will not enjoy. Another frozen thing. Another chest. Another chest. Holy chest, Batman. Yeah, and our pickup range is so high that we're just, uh, we're opening chests that are off the screen at this point is what it seems like to me. Give us a level. There we go. Tw <laughs> yep. All right, 20% more crit damage with a 182% uh, crit rate. I'm seeing big numbers here, Beans. Big, big numbers. And, you know, we're, we're getting to the point where I might just want to, like, you know, let it, uh, let it sit and simmer for a while. And kind of see what uh, happens. Turn off auto leveling. Because I uh, do sometimes forget to do that when I go AFK. 
I don't know. We'll see. I'm still, I'm still vibing. I'm still collecting XP. I'm still feeling like our power levels are spiking astronomically. Well, I feel like we probably have enough of these, but I can't remember, so I'm still gonna grab it. Can't hurt, right? What did I just grab? More XP? Our XP gain has to 14.4 times XP gain. That is, uh, that's a lot of XP, and we're still not popping levels that often. All right, let's see what we got in here. Regen, some defense, more damage. Can't argue with more damage. Another dragon tail. We gotta be over what we need for dragon tails at this point. Uh, yeah, we'll take more luck. We'll take more luck, why not? Killed an elite over here at some point. Bunch of regen. Ah, yes, soul swords. Soul swords it is. I saw something for, yeah, 600,000 over there. 229. We're not up over a million yet, as far as I can tell, so trying to fix that. The numbers don't stay long enough for, for me to, like, count the number of numbers. We might be over a million. Nah, it doesn't look like it. More luck. More luck! XP, defense, and crit damage. That is, uh, we've killed 69,000 enemies. Very nice. And we are about to pop another level. Eventually, some someday. There we go, 15% crit damage. Another dragon tail. Chests on chests on chests. percent base damage absolutely everything we touch dies and we touch uh, a lot of things carving through just hordes of enemies and yeah, we had 69,000 gold this run very nice I don't want to get any more gold then because uh, what a great number to what a great number to end the run at. If we do ever in fact end the run, uh, what happened earlier is like my computer eventually started to not uh, not vibe with it. <laughs> I had to uh, I actually had to manually uh, manually kill the game or uh, at least end the run. Uh, yeah, we'll take Blizzard Blade. We we need to show some more love to to the abilities here. Eventually, yeah, just the amount of shit on screen and damage that I was doing, my computer couldn't handle it. And I was afraid if it crashed, I would lose uh, lose all the progress and the unlocks and the, the meta currency. So I uh, just manly was like, nope. And that's probably what we're going to end up having to do in this one, Beans, because Indiana Jones cannot be killed, cannot be contained. He's done when he says he's done. I don't think we burned a single revive. That's a good feeling. Broke this. Oh shit. That's death. Uh sure. More more damage. Get us over a million and then we'll talk game. 729,000 somewhere over there.
And... Just enough XP to fund the economy of a small third world country going on right now. Not a large third world country, but a small one, certainly. Have a chest down here that we didn't open up. Look at our shotgun going hog wild right now. I like that. Indy with a double barrel and a penchant for murder. I'm sorry, what is this? What is happening? Is that our waves? That must be it. Must be for Blizzard Blade. All right, well, shit. Oh my God, and it's sharks. That's really cool. I enjoy that. I enjoy that a lot. Yeah, I don't know what's going on at this point. Well, now we just kind of sit back, relax, max and all cool, shooting some b-ball outside of the school. We're launching murderous sharks out of solid ground, which is kind of terrifying. The elusive land shark. Oh, there, yeah, I was gonna say, I saw I saw an elite ever so briefly up here, so we're gonna grab his chest. Aw, oh, we got more gold, damn it. 15% uh, crit damage. Everything is chaos. We are the problem. And the solution. Look at all this death. Brings a tear to my eye. Or that's the allergies. Alright, Beans, we've been playing for 48 minutes, so I'm just gonna kind of, uh,. Oh, thought we were going to get a level 48 minutes, 49 minutes now. Level 100. I'm just going to kind of let it go for a while and see what uh, see what happens. I'll get back to you and uh, just kind of do a cut here and get back to you when uh, when something, something happens, I guess. All right, beans. Let's see. 70 minutes. Uh, I just took I just took a nice long slow shower and uh, came back to this. We got eight level ups. Let's see what we got here. Crit damage, fire shield, damage, luck, lizard blade, luck, and uh, holy shit! Look at all these chests. This is gonna crash my game probably. <laughs> what is happening? All right. We, uh, I, I am saying that we have officially broken the game at this point. I don't know what, uh, what else to call it, really. Let's see, Fire Shield now lasts forever, more XP, Blizzard Blades, Soul Swords, Soul Swords. Oh, Beans, this is, uh, this is a spicy run for sure. Well, if we didn't have enough Dragon Tails before, we certainly do now. I am perfectly comfortable saying that. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, beans. I uh, I think it's I think it's safe to say that we have completely destroyed this game at this point. So uh, yeah, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna leave it there. Uh, exit. There we go. Let's see. Oh my god, so much. Three. 235 
blue chests, 11. Oh my goodness. Beans, thank you so much for coming out and hanging out with me today, watching this absolute banger of a run. And I uh, really, really appreciate you guys taking the time out of your day to peruse the content that I'm creating for y'all and come and just hang out. So thank you so much, you guys. Make sure you like today's video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I love you, Beans, so very, very much. And I'll see you in the next one. Love you. Bye. Mwah. Remember, Toe Beans, like, comment, subscribe, or else I'll cry myself to sleep tonight.